Hey wolves and welcome back to another video on my channel and today we're here with In Sound Mine and we are exactly where we left off last video so if you guys haven't checked out the last videos go and check them out and come and watch this afterwards but this game is really awesome I'm really enjoying it and it's perfect for spooky season so yeah continue on watching and I hope you guys enjoy it happy spooky season Ooh, ship and fish. There's a ship. Anyways, let's go. Oh god, me and jumping are not. I barely did not make that. <laughs> I fell in the water a couple of times, but I almost did not make that one. Oh, his is on the ground instead of on the post. Okay, Mr. Shore, tape's running. Thank you for agreeing to be recorded. Oh, um, should I just start talking? What do you want to know? Uh, what made you decide to seek counseling? Oh, man, Doc, it's, it's just weird. As in, I feel weird, like, like I'm weird all the time, you know? I'm not saying this right. People think I'm weird, and it's cool I am, but I, I shouldn't feel weird, right? Hmm. How exactly do you feel weird? Off, odd, and slightly tilted. I, I've had these nightmares ever since I can remember. I've always had these horrific dreams I can't explain. And, and they recur. Man, like there are themes in them that keep coming back. And uh, honestly, Doc, it's been such a constant that I, I shape my life around them, you know? Hmm. What the heck is this? What the hell? Have you ever seen anyone about these recurring nightmares? Like a shriek like you? No. Honestly, for the longest time I thought it was normal life to wake up sweating, to see things in the dark, frightful things. No, that is not normal, my dude. Not at all. But if you've been seeing it your whole entire life, I guess you could find it as normal, because it always happens to you. So... What is it that frightens you, Alan? See, see that's the thing I don't get. My, my whole life, I could feel the presence of shadows. I could hear sorrow in the dark. It's poetic, man, I know. I, I got so used to being paralyzed by dread that I... People notice, you know, I, I, I say weird stuff sometimes, I guess. At some point, I just decided to live comfortably in this reality, maintaining a beacon of light over a sea of darkness, alone and afraid. But I'd be lying if I didn't admit that it being swallowed by darkness or sinking in the depths. It makes me feel alive, man. It's electric. Sprinting in this game is so weird. Sometimes it'll work and sometimes it won't. It's kind of annoying. Like, please work. Like, it, and it's, and then it starts working and then I stop, hmm, I don't know. Ugh. Seriously, I don't know. Sprinting in this game, I always have issues with it. I don't know why, but whatever. I make progress eventually. So we got a new patient named Alan. I wonder, I don't know what his problem is. That he he feels weird and he sees dark things. He has bad dreams and always sees dark shadows and 
the shadows? Hmm. Okay, so here we are in a new area. I got the thing saying, explore the area. So, that's what I'll do. Look at you, Mr. Private Detective. What do you think is behind all this? Bigfoot? Aliens? Big, bad government officials? Shed some light on the situation, why don't ya? Okay. Ooh, glad to see it's still good. These places are absolutely freaking gorgeous, by the way. <gasps> Excuse me, sir! Can you not? Thanks. I hate that guy. <laughs> but yeah, these places are absolutely gorgeous. I love them. They're all so unique and amazing. There's a light. When there's a light, I always go towards it because it might show me something. Okay, so there's a way up there. What is going on? There's so much noise going on around me. Bright light. Light. The light. I have to restore it. Restore the light. <gasps> what the frig? What just hit the light? What just happened? I have no idea what just happened. Okay, so I have to restore the light. Oh, do I have to restore the light at the um thing over there? Oh! I understand what's going on now. I have to restore the light and the thing is trying to kill me. Ooh, hate that. Birds. So that's what hit the thing. Scared the living daylights out of me. I'm like, what the hell happened? So we gotta go to the lighthouse. What do you want? In Greek mythology, Icarus flies too close to the sun and it kills him. I'll spare you the analogy. In our story, you're going to bring the sun to Alan, and the both of you will burn. Jeez, thanks. That I was safe, I was wrong. Ouch. Okay, don't get close to that. Ouch. Oh god. I knew it was coming back around, I should have just waited. Like one of those guys. Oh, there he is. <gasps> Oof, okay. I'm good. At least my health is at. Ah! God, there's more of them coming. Okay, they gave up. Good. What 
the fuck is coming? What is going on? I'm so confused. That was so weird. Oh, the phone ringing. I'll say it later. Higher and higher in the sky. Do you think Icarus contemplated how weird a person he was? Why can't he just be normal? Do you think his parents pushed him to be a lawyer? To be a doctor? Like your parents did? Yeah, I feel like... It's blocked from the other side. Well, there's a phone ringing. I can't get in. Phone stopped ringing, so I guess the guy's like waiting for us to pick up. Oh wait, there's no phone in here. Oh, I thought there was a phone in there, or maybe there is. I don't know. Can't get in. Oh, the phone's over here. Well, I just ignored you. Sorry about that. Is anybody even out there? Oh, here it comes. I feel bad because that guy was calling me and I'm just like, yeah, I'm too busy trying to get in the shed. And I thought the phone was in the shed, so I thought, oh, I have to get inside to be able to, you know, answer the phone. But the phone was actually... Oh, there's a way in there, but I don't know how to get up there. Hmm. Well, I guess I'll just have to move on. Eventually. How do you get in? I don't know how to get in. I want to get in. I don't know how to get in. There's an opening at the top, but I can't climb this. Or I would. Yeah, so I guess I have to move on. Oof. Hmm. Sorry for ignoring that guy's call. I didn't mean to. It sucks that I missed that guy's call. What is going on? Well, there's that guy. So there's that guy that's been following us around. He's over there. And he disappeared. Okay. As investigation is ongoing, according to Milton Hev Heaven Sheriff's Office, the details of the uh, above mentioned phone call must remain undisclosed, but this reporter and Hamamar Employee of the Month has a knack for getting in trouble a knack for getting in trouble in order to get at the truth more of the follow on more to follow on the next edition of Milton mystery huh authorized to be constructed by the president Washington in 1795 and complete in 1797 at a cost of a lot of money. When the lighthouse was completed, in st it stood some tree 300 feet from the edge of the cliff. The sandstone tower is 28 feet in diameter of an out 
octagon shape and 80 feet to the lantern. Also, who cares? We're all, we're all going to die sooner or later, and these facts mean nothing. Are you, are you even sure that you're really standing here reading this? Maybe this is some sort of horrific fever dream. Here's a random number. Okay, Alan Shore was burned alive by the government. Wow, okay. Danger. No unauthorized entry. Dangerous chemicals and biological agents have been detec detected in this area. Milton Ware some lighthouse, which may lead to seriously injured illnesses or death. Well then. Oh, these are explosions. Explosives. Okay, so I can't get in here though. So what was the point in coming here? There's unnatural darkness here. Yeah. Ah, okay. Had to jump up these boxes. And then get in that way. Gotcha. <gasps> what the frick? Show you something. Ah, I found that. I found it. I'm going to go. Jesus eh. This manic probably melted the keys to all of these doors along with his damned house. When management hears about it, it's your it's gonna be your ass. Get someone to go in in there and fish them out if they still exist. I'm not sell setting a foot in there. The whole thing seems unstable and smells of burnt human flesh. Ew. Door's locked. Ah! Ah! So the green's over here. Ah. I hate this guy. Okay, there's a thing over there. I don't know what the frick I'm doing. I got this guy up my ass. Get off me. Oh, there's two of them. Oh my lord. I hate this thing. I hate it super badly. He will not leave me alone. This doesn't work. He will not leave me alone. I'm trying to do something and he's all up my ass. Oh my god. Leave me alone! Jump for the love of God! Jump! I'm pressing jump! Oh my god, this guy will not leave me alone. Get off! Get the fuck off me! Like, sh go the fuck away! That's not what I meant. Oh my lord. Oh, I'm Get on, on. Um, okay, so turn something on. I don't know what. What burns? Oh, the light burns him? Oh, there's eyes actually in there. Yeah, so he won't go near here. But I, can't, I don't have any, like, anything else. Yeah, so just stay uh, away from here. Nice. 
But the, what do I do? I don't have any more. It's a fuse box. No, not working. What do I do then? The I put the thing over there, turned this light on, but now I need fuses. God, it's so hard. He's dragging me inward. He's dragging me into the into him. Too much for one man. Ah. It's so hard. It's so hard. I I want to check this door, but then it comes over. Locked. Oh, there's a thing over here. He's just dragging me in. It's so annoying. Get off me, please. Get off me! You damn fucking annoying person, Alan. God. I did it, Alan. It wasn't great. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, I can't see a damn thing. Help. Hmm. Aha! Another fuse. Okay, so I got another fuse. Finally, I'm making progress again. What do I do? I finally managed to get Okay, I can't cut that. I don't know why my flashlight doesn't work in this area. Like why doesn't the flashlight like get rid of the darkness? Who freaking knows? Take a look at yourself through the looking glass and see how shrouded in darkness and darkness a mind like Alan's could be. Out of fuel. Huh. Oh, wait. Let there be light. Fish. Light my fire. The lantern is. Oh, come on. Make it bright. Illuminate. Yes. Okay. I. I forgot about the freaking shard of glass, and the indicator was me stepping on this glass. And I'm an idiot. It's out of fuel. It's an old oil lantern. Okay, I made progress. Of I was in the tower when it happened. I took the route down the cliff and to the boathouse. Following as I fumbled around, unable to see. Huh. Where the 
the brick. Oh, this is brighter than my torch that I have, but whatever. Of all the nightmares I'd had to date, this must be the worst. My light went out and there was an accident. Oh god, it's all my fault. My light went out and there was an accident? Huh. to find one of those flare guns from inside the belly of the beast. I'm not afraid to use it. The monsters I was told that I was making up have now stepped forth out of the shadows. Oof. There's a tunnel. Sunken to the bottom. There's things outside. I need more oil though. Crash. Crash. Flawed, but fixable. Okay, found another oil can finally. It's blocked by darkness. It's out of fuel. <gasps> Jesus Christ. It's an old oil lantern. Oh, come on. Oh my gosh. more oil. The darkness will burn. I need to call Desmond. He would understand. So I can't go over there for some reason. Can't. I wish I could pick up the lantern and just bring it with me. Ugh. Oh, I feel shivers down my spine. There's a lantern here. It's again. out of fuel. Oh. I just need to die. 
Okay, try this again. I'm starting to get tired, so I might end this video soon because I'm starting to get tired. It is 12 o'clock at night here, so it's super late. Oh no. It didn't save my progress. No. Oh my gosh. Ugh. I did all that and it didn't save any of it. Love that for me. <gasps> Jesus. He's here this time. What? You just sit there and stare at me? Okay, we're just having a staring contest. No big deal. So this time he was in this room. The lantern is off. Okay, so I got a key, but where's it for? Wait, I got a key for what? I got a key for what, game? Oh, that back door. Oh no, I don't know where the back door is. Ah! I don't know where to go. I'm gonna die again. I'm going to die again. Wait, where's the back door? <sighs> okay, so I got a key for the back door, but I don't know where the fuck the back door is because the guy is destroying everything. So the layout of the house is completely destroyed. So I don't know where to go. So I'm just wandering around like a freaking idiot trying to find a way out. Okay, let's see if I can do this now. What the? Oh, the light does work. Okay. I don't know what to do. I fell off. How do I get up there? Okay, so my light does work. Okay, now I can- Okay, I found where I need to be. I got all confused. Okay. So my do my light does work on him. Cool. Okay, where do I go though? Cause I got a key for something. Ah. Okay. Finally made progress. Jesus. So I got a key for here. The door leading to the courtyard is locked. Oh, okay. Finally, find a frickin' Lee. I didn't use my gun. Can you even use your gun on the, on the him? I don't even know. It did save, it did save, it did. Um, so, I'm gonna call it here. I think this is a good place to stop it. Sorry for uh, dying twice. I just got all confused and I didn't know that my tor because earlier my torch didn't work on him. So I'm like, oh, so it doesn't work on him. But I guess maybe it does if you're looking straight down. I wasn't looking straight down at him. I was looking straight ahead. So my torch might have worked on him if I thought about looking down because he's he hates light. So. Sorry, like I said, it's 12 o'clock at night here, so I'm not in the right, you know, thinking 
pro you know, my brain's not like, yeah, I can think. Anyways, that is going to be the end of this video, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Ring that bell if you want to see more videos from me. Subscribe if you want to. And I'll see you, beautiful night wolves, in the next video. Goodbye.